By definition, panic attacks are unexpected. A death in the family, stress at work, or a bad breakup can make panic attacks more likely. Some people may have a panic attack once in their life. Others can have them every few weeks. Often, someone can be in a stressful situation and have a panic attack, which may lead to a specific fear or phobia. For example, if a woman has a panic attack in an elevator, she may develop a fear of elevators. Every time she walks into an elevator, she'll risk another panic episode and may avoid elevators. Panic attacks are isolated events, but when people have recurring panic attacks without clear triggers and come to fear having more unexpected attacks, they may be diagnosed with panic disorder. When people avoid going out of the house for fear of panic, that is called agoraphobia. Panic attacks are common nationwide, happening in up to 11% of US citizens per year. It affects people of all genders, ages, and ethnicities. However, there are some people who are more likely to have panic attacks. If a family member has regular panic attacks, there's an increased chance that relatives will have panic attacks. People with mental health conditions, including anxiety disorders, post-traumatic stress disorder, and drug and alcohol use disorders are also more likely to suffer from panic attacks.